Hey guys, welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you um, how to use your Jeep Grand Cherokee in the snow with the 242 Select Track transfer case. Uh, I get asked all the time, you know, what, it, uh, what do I select on the transfer case when I'm driving around on the street? And it's a little confusing. Everybody always asks me, do I use the full time four wheel drive or the part time four wheel drive? And when should I use each um, option? And uh, what I'll do is I'll cover that in the video. And uh, remember, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We'll get all kinds of great stuff coming up. All right, so if you're on the highway and let's say you're heading home from work and it's snowing out and the highway is starting to get covered with snow, what you're going to want to use, and the road conditions are like snow pavement, snow pavement, you're going to want to use the uh, full-time four-wheel drive. You don't want to put the um, truck into part-time. With the full-time four-wheel drive do in that type of a condition is if you're going along on the highway let's say you're going along at like 45 50 miles an hour the road conditions are getting bad and uh the speed limits are starting to come down and you know you get a condition where it's snow patches pavement patches um, the reason why you use that setting is so that jeep has designed the drivetrain so it sends power to the tire that's slipping, more power to the tire that's slipping in that setting. So the reason for that is, is, is if you're going along and you hit a piece of pavement, it has less of a tendency to spin the vehicle out. So it'll send power to the wheel that's slipping and it'll set the torque in the drivetrain so it doesn't like jar the vehicle to the left or to the right and put the power in the wrong spot. So. Uh, that's why you want to use that setting in that type of a condition. Okay, so when you have snow like this, you can leave the truck in full time, full wheel drive. And uh, we have like some snow cover and some patches of pavement. That way there, the uh, the, tra the transfer of the power is 40% to the front wheel, 60 to the rear. And the reason why that is is so that you don't spin the vehicle out if you have um, like a dry patch or something like that the, the power can't transfer around the drivetrain for you so if the back roads are like this and they're totally snow covered you can put the um, transfer case into part-time four-wheel drive and what that'll do is it'll lock the uh, front differential the rear differential and it'll divide the power between the two 50 50 so that both front tires and rear tires get equal power uh, you don't want to use this on the highway because it could ruin the transfer case. It's made for slow speeds, like you know, back roads, 30 mile hour stuff, and like going through the woods. So I hope you liked the video and you learned something from it. Um, you know, it can be confusing with this transfer case and the way everything is labeled. And uh, remember to subscribe to the channel, and you'll get all the latest and greatest uploads. Take it easy.